Hello, in this video, we'll cover how to manage consumption in the Azure portal. We'll go over how to view reservation transaction details, view usages and charges at the billing account and department level, view credit details, and how to view invoices in the Azure portal as an enterprise administrator. After logging into the Azure portal and selecting the desired billing account, to view reservation details, we'll need to navigate to the reservation transactions blade under billing. Here we can see all of the ongoing reservations being billed to this account. We can filter out by purchases, refunds, and cancellations, and we can filter out by a custom time span. Next, to view the usages and charges to this billing account, we'll click the usage and charges blade under billing. In the usage and charges blade, we see the usage month charges against credits, which is the credit applied during that specific period. The service overage, which is our organization's usage charges, which exceeds our credit balance. Our build separately amount, which is the services our organization used, which aren't covered by the credit. Our Azure marketplace charges, which are purchases and usage that aren't covered by our organization's credit and our bills separately. At the bottom, we see, we see the 12 month total for the charges against credits, service overage, billed separately, Azure Marketplace, and total charges amount. We'll click the download button, and here we can see that we can download usage details, marketplace store charge details, a price sheet, and a balance and summary CSV for every given month. To see usages and charges at the department level, we'll need to navigate into a department in the department's blade. Then we'll navigate to usages and charges in the department. And here we'll see the same view, but for the department selected. We'll navigate back to the billing account and we'll click the credits blade. In this view, you'll be able to see the balance month by month and any adjustments and credits applied to our charges. Next, we'll go over how to view and download invoices in the Azure portal. We'll need to navigate to the invoices blade under billing. And here we can see a list of all of our invoices. We can see the document date, the invoice number, the billing period associated to that invoice, the PO number, and the total amount of that invoice. In this context menu, we have the option to download it or to see the document numbers. To download, I we'll want to click the download button in the context menu. A PDF is prepared and generated if there are charges in the billing period. Once the document is loaded successfully, we'll have the option to press download. In this video, we've covered how to view reservation details, view charges at the enrollment and department level, and view credit details in the Azure portal. Thank you for watching, and I hope this helped.